Hooray for Hollywood! Hello there, I'm Stan the Movie Man, and this is your WIMC.com movie review. This week, your votes at WIMC.com sent me to see the movie Push. It is about a group of young people who are hiding out in Hong Kong because they possess telekinetic, psychic, uh, or other special abilities because back in the Second World War, people were experimented on by the Nazis to amplify their uh, psychic abilities and over time they have leaked out into the general population. A secret organization called The Division is trying to round up all these um, uh, various specials or telekinetics or whatever their special uh, talent might be and give them a serum which will amplify their abilities and make a super soldier army out of all of these folks. The movie stars uh, Chris Evans, who you may remember from both of the uh, Fantastic Four movies. He was Johnny Storm, the Human Torch. And Dakota Fanning uh, is also in the film. She and uh, her character Cassie and Evans' character Nick team up and look for Kira, who has some case or something that uh, Cassie in her uh, psychic visions has seen that will set all of the uh, special people free from the division. Uh, the film has been roundly panned in uh, various reviews um, and I can understand why, but I think it's better than they're giving them credit for. The, the film is, is kind of talky, I'll give you that. The action scenes though are pretty good. Uh, the use of the uh, telekinetic powers um, and the the way the people who can read the future interact with uh, the other folks who have special abilities um, it's all it's it that part of it is pretty interesting the the long segments where they're just sort of talking to each other kind of gets kind of boring to be honest with you but you need those parts to get to the action scenes. Now, they could have probably tightened up the, um, the, the dialogue quite a bit to move it, uh, move the story along faster. Um, of course, then they would have to spend more money on special effects. I, I'd say the film didn't cost a whole lot to make. Uh, it was probably shot primarily in Hong Kong where it is set. Um, I, and, you know, it, it isn't as bad as the reviewers will make it sound. It, it is, like I said, talky. But I kind of got into the story. I kind of got into the characters. And I wanted to know how they were going to get out of the trouble they were in and uh, their backstories and, and uh, their histories and, and all that stuff. And I actually found it pretty entertaining. Now, the way it's set up, there could be a sequel I doubt it's going to make enough money to make another sequel, at least with this cast, or make a sequel with this cast, but you never can tell. But I, I actually kind of enjoyed the film. I'm going to ask that you give it a chance and see what you think. Um, I'm giving Push four guitars. Go to WIMZ.com and read my complete review as well as to vote on the movie. I'll see you next time. Till next time, Stan the Movie Man. I'm going to push my way out of here. <laughs> He, oh, that worked.